I fell off the mountain ledge, but luckily, my fall was broken by a wolf. The wolf attacked me, but fortunately, I had a pistol hidden in my moustache. I shot him, but he was only wounded, and took my hand. What, in marriage? <laughs> After fighting with the wolf, I set off to find the egg of Mantumbi, a sapphire as big as a schoolboy's head. All right, you two beatniks. What do you think this is? A day at the races with Uncle Bobo? This is a real live action man with loads of action stories. Now listen up and fly right. Go ahead, pumpkin. It's all right, Fossil. Let the boys have their fun. Because I understand it took Howard Moon one month to grow that moustache. <laughs> <laughs> Check the inset cabinet. I think we're one caterpillar short. Yeah! <laughs> Do that! Many have tried to find the egg of Mantumbi. Many have failed. No one has come so close as the famous explorer, Biggie Shackleton. It is said that Biggie knew the exact whereabouts of the sacred egg and was within days of finding it. When, as legend has it, he was frozen to death by a hideous, icy bastard known to the locals as Black Frost. Wow, Frosty. You said it, bitch. Up until now, the Egg of Mantumbi has eluded me, but I shall return to the Arctic, not for the money or the fame, but for Biggie Shackleton, whose icy encounter with Black Frost left him crushed and lifeless, like crisps under bison. I don't like to end on a download. Here's a song. Turn around. Every now and then I get a little bit lonely and you're never coming round. Turn around, bright eyes. Every now and then I fall apart. And I need you more tonight. And I need you more tonight.